I arrived to UK in 2012 as a refugee with my father. My journey from, from Dagestan to where I am now has been very difficult. We didn't have anything. He's a product of his environment and his experiences. He's had some tough things that he's had to come through. Many people compare me to Habib because we are both undefeated. We're both from Dagestan. But I built my own history. They call me like Muhammad Makaev, not Habib too. I want to be youngest champion in UFC, and I believe I can. Many people think like UK doesn't have a wrestling, right? But I learned everything from zero in, in UK. I, I went to wrestling in Dagestan maybe two, three times in, in training session, but I started competing a lot in wrestling around the UK, winning like British championships five times in a row. I think the discipline, there's definitely some crossover with his religion. No partying, never been to a bar before. And with being from Dagestan, there must be something in the water there. Khabib's obviously the, the most well-known fighter out of that region. Khabib is a great example for everyone, you know. I can have better career than Khabib uh, because I have amateur record. 23 wins, no losses, and the professional record, six wins, no losses. It's okay. <laughs> My mom passed away in 2012. <sighs> everything, everything started from, from zero. My father uh, faced like uh, political issues in Dagestan. He came here as a refugee. Like 30 days he was in Liverpool refugee center. There was like five pounds every day they used to give. And it wasn't much money. Then we moved to Wigan and I didn't understand that situation properly. There was a lot of adversity for him and he was always fighting people because he didn't know the language. He didn't understand the culture. Sometimes I, I get in trouble in school. I didn't understand all the like, jokes and somebody swearing. And it's, it's not normal where I come from. Coming here as, as, a, as a young boy, getting into wrestling was probably what he needed. He found a community, he found a purpose. Yeah, Din is one of the biggest parts in my career. He helped me a lot. He doesn't have an ego, he, he understands my lifestyle. Oh, David took enough punishment there this morning. Oh. Hello, hello. <laughs> come in, come in. Ten years. Live vegan, third house. Double Very happy neighbors. Happy. Good, good people around there. Просто я знал, что будет совсем нехорошо. Поэтому я решил уже все. Денег у нас. My father, um, when we moved to Wigan, he couldn't work officially, so he was on benefits. That's why I, I tried to stay hungry, you know, like to earn money, and I don't want to come back to that situation again in my life. Okay, so it was more difficult before. Hundred <laughs> percent. Different life. You don't know. You see, Ukraine war problem. No good. I have a lot of respect for my father. He dealt with all hard situation, and I'm really thankful for that. So I told him, listen, sit down, you know, relax. Old man now, and I, now it's my time to look after him. I'm the most happiest father. I am very happy, proud. 10 million that one good sportsman. Like in 2018, I did tell Dana White I'm gonna be in four years time in UFC. Still got the messages, you know, and uh, and in four years time I'm, I'm having debut day. Like if I lose, this all can disappear. But that's why I have to stay focused till I reach my final goal. When I put all this work in, it get, boosts my confidence up. And then when I go inside the cage, I have fire in my eyes that, that opponents just, just lose their mind when they see me. Some people think it's hype, but some people, like when they train with me, they spread the word around, you know, and they know what was the, is the real deal. Yes, my journey from, from Dagestan to where I am now has been it's very difficult, but it made me who I am today. I just can't imagine what that lad would do if he were a fighter. It's what he's born to do. Habib, you know, 
he set a good example for everybody. But I have my different story, different path in this life. My main dream is to become UFC youngest champion.